several events that have occurred at Castleberry High School during the first six weeks uh, were certainly three things that we would like to share with you. First was academics. When we received the news in September that we earned four distinctions for our accountability rating for the 2015-2016 school years for academic achievement in English reading, math, science, and closing the performance gaps. The second thing that we celebrated was that we decreased our percentage of discipline referrals that were submitted to the office by 50% as compared to last year's first six weeks. And then the third thing that we celebrated during the first six weeks was the fact that we had the highest first six weeks attendance rate that we have had in the last five years at Castleberry High School. Currently the education activities that we're working with here at Castleberry High School are working with our daily PLCs uh, with our department so we get together and we talk about common goals and common assessments that we want the kids to be able to achieve. Uh, we learned a lot of these strategies when we went to San Antonio over the summer. We also decided as a campus team to start working on only accepting five-star responses rather than yes or no answers and increasing the rigor of our questioning. Um, when you're making the students think a little bit more in depth about the question of the subject, we learn that they retain their information a lot better. Another thing that we're working with is uh, working on creating a positive climate. So having building the relationship with the kids so that they want to come to school. They want to be here, they want to get to know us, and we want to get to know them. And if you walk down the hall and on any given day, you'll see that the kids have that relationship with their teachers. They enjoy being here. They, they like coming to our class. And then when it, time comes around, they don't really want to leave some of them. In our classes, the three main components that I see or that I experience throughout the day is teamwork, group learning, and self-guided learning. So pretty much all the time we're going to use teamwork to solve a problem, to find a method for something that we've never done before. And self-guided, well, like we, we're on our own, but we also have the teacher that facilitates us and helps us throughout the way, uh, like a helping hand. My name is Christy Skinner and it is my pleasure to be the pre-AP Freshman English 1 teacher here at Castleberry High School. Here at Castleberry we're doing everything we can to make sure that our students are prepared for success beyond high school, especially when they go out into the levels of higher education that they're going to face in the college world. A lot of it really hinges on our use of technology. We spend a lot of time um, advancing our understanding of various concepts by using technology for students to search things that interest them and at the same time make connections with what we're reading. My name is Stephanie Bolero and I'm the Director of Bands for Castleberry High School. October is competition month. This month we've been to two competitions already and hopefully at least two more. So the first competition we went to was on October 1st in Sunnyvale and we made a first division and placed fifth in the finals out of 22 bands. And the next Saturday, we went to Springtown for our next competition. We did very, very well at that competition, beating some 5A and 6A bands. We made a first division, advanced to finals, and made ninth place in finals there at Springtown. This Saturday is our UIL competition. We hope to make a first division at UIL, and then that will let us advance to area. Area would be the next weekend in Belton. And if we make it to area finals, that's how we would make it to state in November. Castleberry High School, we certainly like to set SMART goals for ourselves. So during the first faculty meeting, we certainly set the goal for ourselves that we, by the end of this school year, we wanted to achieve five distinctions uh, on our accountability rating once those come out next fall. And we're hoping to either achieve the social studies distinction or the post-secondary readiness distinction. Mm -hmm. 